what's kind of the overall message in the locker room after? Um, I think we just try to take the positives out of everything. Um, you know, obviously we wanted to win, but like you said, uh, trying to take the positives from it and grow. It's a long season, so, um, you know, it's unfortunate it hurts, but we've got another game. We've got a few home, more home games coming up right now. So, uh, like I said, just trying to move on to the next one and just try to take the good things, um, carry on, and then eliminate the bad things. You mentioned the word growth, and Steve Nash said that you, he got, he's seeing that in glimpses of it. For you, you got to go into impressive moments. What allowed you to get, kind of get going? Uh, I think coming in and just understanding my role, um, you know, pretty early on this year, you know, Steve told me that, you know, my role would probably be coming in and trying to defend, bring in energy, hustle plays, things like that. Um, offensively, things will come, but mainly defensively, like locking in on my assignment and doing my job. And I just try to do that to the best of my ability, you know, and tonight uh, it worked for me. Um, had some good moments. Uh, like I said, overall, we didn't get the window. So, you know, that's the most important thing. You definitely got to go back, watch some film and see how we can correct it. On the defensive side, Kyrie has mentioned about having more defensive pride. You guys got were able to get a lot of stops there in the second half. What did you see was it the dif biggest difference point? Um, I think uh, just staying locked in over the course of four quarters. You know, today was overtime too, so um, staying locked in for even longer and longer. You know, it's a long game. You know, guys get tired, not just physically, but, you know, mentally. And um, it's a mental game. So I think that's will be our next step is just like continuing to, you know, stay locked in for longer.